Today's video has two primary objectives. First and foremost, I'm curious how good of a team we can get from this. I mean, this is $500 worth of packs. How good of a team can we get? And then number two is my stub count. How many stubs can I get? 390 standards, seven chase packs, and three diamond duos. 600 stubs in my account, and a complete squad of common. This is an experiment. Now, the first thing we're obviously going to do is we have 390 standard packs sitting here. Let's burn through them. All right, we got our first diamond. We're only like four standards in. We got our first purple diamond. Now, all the live series diamonds are at least going to have their base value and quick sell, but they're going to go on the squad first just to see what the team looks like. And then at the end of the video, we'll do all of our selling and see how many stubs we have. Seeger in there at shortstop. There's our first diamond, and we still have 385 standard packs. Diamond number two. What is going on? Two diamonds in less than 10 packs? Is this like the perfect time to open packs? Did we nail this? Is this about to go crazy? Luba! Oh, live series Julio Rodriguez, who is supercharged at the time I'm making this. Uh oh, here we go. Diamond number three. We're down. Oh, it's a teal. It's not teal. It's blue. It's blue. I'll take it though. It's better than anything that's not purple is better than purple. Is that a okay? It's pretty much, it might as well have been purple. To Dolis Garcia, who's up to a 91 overall, but he's at quick sell value. Primary right field, we'll throw him in right. 305 packs for main. That is our third diamond in 85 packs. And just like that, hey, let's go. That's a huge fourth diamond right there. Right when I started talking, I had a feeling it was going to be purple. I had to trend back down eventually. It's going to be a live series diamond here right at the 250 mark. There's Josh Hader, which is a pretty nice add to the lineup. If you're looking at it from that regard, there's not going to be very many good relievers in this video. That's for sure. But we're at exactly 250 packs. We still have the seven chase packs, which is a guaranteed seven diamonds and three loose diamond duo packs. Let's just open these right now. At 140 packs in right now, we're doing these diamond duos. JD Martinez, one more, and Kodai Senga. Just some thoughts here at the 150 pack mark. I only have 8,000 stubs in my inventory. Granted, there's probably a half dozen golds that I quick flipped past that I could go through and sell them, probably at around 15,000 stubs. We're about 30 to 35,000 stubs once I sell the diamonds that we put in our lineup. But we've opened 350 bundles and really we haven't gotten the stubs back for 150 bundle yet. That's without opening the chase packs, which are last. Let's see how the rest of these standard packs treat us before we get into that. 249 to go. Diamond, diamond number five is purple, violet. And that fifth purple is Pablo Lopez of the Minnesota Twins. I love those Twin City City Connect. That's our first starting pitcher that we've landed on. Put him in rotation. All right, we got a Diamond Angels uniform. I'll take that thousand. And we have two more packs until we hit the, the 200 pack mark. And we're still under 15,000 subs in return value. Oh man, this is why I went and got a coffee for this. I had a bad feeling. This is definitely gonna be one of those videos where like it's gonna be a prime example of why you don't open pack. 200 more to go. I need at least one more teal diamond before we get into the chase pack. Uh oh, we just got a chase pack in a standard pack. So we'll sit that aside. We're now up to eight chase packs. I was kind of hoping to get a handful of more of those. I was hoping maybe we can get up to nine or ten on the chase packs before we got into them. We'll see. Still got a bunch to go here. Uh-oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> it's been 86 years since our last diamond pull. Number six coming in hot. It's another purple diamond. There's some pretty solid purple diamonds in the game, though. Not in value, but duplicates do not help us in any way, shape, or form whatsoever. 3,700 stubs right there. The first diamond that we actually sell. We have 169 packs to go. Diamond number seven. I auto-flipped and um, wasn't even paying attention at first. Another purple diamond. We're stacking them up. Now, at this point, I just want extra chase packs. I don't even necessarily care about these. We're going to fill the lineup up uh, just off of the chase packs. Adley Rutschman's going to go in as our catcher. We'll replace Gary. 
Uh-oh, diamond number eight out of a loose pack. Another purple. Is that nine? Is that eight, nine? I don't even know anymore. I don't even know anymore! Marcus Simeon! 89 overall live series. He's almost a blue diamond. There's 7,000 stubs there on that return. Oh, I forgot to put him in second. Here, look, I put him at second base anyway. How about that? 110 packs to go, and then our eight chase diamond packs. We're at 34,000 stubs, and ready to roll. Diamond, and a gold glove in here. Hopefully that's a good sign. It's another purple. Another purple. Give me another 89, though. Feed me all of those 7,000s uh, quick sell value. That Ozzy Albies. 97 packs to go after that Ozzy Albies pull. We are under 100 packs now. Max Scherzer here, gold 83. We're at 62. 62 standard packs. We will take uh, we'll take another little break and update at 50. We got 10 to go. All right, I, I think I over ripped. Yeah, we're down to 45. Let's pause here. We have eight chase packs still. Was hoping to get more towards 10. We'll be lucky if we even get one more of those. 45 standards, 39,000 stubs. And if we were to hop into a ranked seasons game, not counting any of the golds or silvers or anything like that, this is the, the current team we would have. Live series, Rutschman, Seeger, Simeon, Lou Bob, <laughs> Dolis Garcia, with uh, J-Rod, Supercharged, Ozzy Albies on the bench, Pablo Lopez on the mound, and Josh Hader as your closer. It's kind of incredible that you can't really pull anything other than live series cards out of standard. I feel like if they just like threw some of the chase pack rewards into the standard packs from time to time, it would bring the prices on those down a hair. Like Ellie still being 600K is nuts. They should leak him into standards a little bit. By the way, guys, I'm getting really close to 200,000 subscribers shout out to the shorts algorithm we're gaining a couple thousand subs a month again subscribe if you are new we're gonna say 200k 45 standards to go let's burn through the rest of these and then get into the good stuff that you've been waiting for this whole time diamond purple again we're on a run of purple luck here down the stretch of these standard packs. We're almost done these standard packs. By the way, as soon as we're done, we're gonna go through the inventory. I'm gonna sell all of the duplicate golds that we've gotten. We got the 87 overall Garrett Cole here. I'm gonna sell all of the duplicate golds that we pulled. I'm gonna keep all of the duplicate silvers and bronze cards just because they help me with the exchanges. When the new team affinity comes out, I'll be able to get a boost in the team affinity by using all those duplicate bronze and silver cards. Get the exchanges for some uh, head start points in there. Get some packs and diamonds unlocked right away with those exchanges. But the golds have good value. So we will go through and sell those. There was a handful that I skimmed right through. Probably got a good 20K in gold sitting in our inventory right now. Diamond? Dang it. All these purples. The packs are hot, I will say though. Odds are good. Diamond to pack ratio is very good. Just not having a ton of luck on colors. We have Jazz Chisholm. Jazz gonna go into the lineup. Do we even have a center fielder? Yeah, we do have a center fielder in Lou Bob, so we'll just throw him at DH. Nine more standard packs, and then eight chase pack six. Jacob DeGrom is worth about 270,000 stubs right now. Just pulling him once would be awesome. That would get the majority of our stubs back. I did buy all of these bundles when they were, are they, as a matter of fact, are the packs still? Yeah, the packs are 20% off at the, in the store at the time I bought these, so I didn't spend full dollar on these. I got them at 20% off. 25,000 coins back would be pretty big. Three more standard packs. Another one, there it is. We did end up getting one more. So we're down to, or I'm sorry, we're up to nine. We're down to just two standard packs remain. Last one here. Nine chase packs. I'm just gonna go through, sell all these duplicate golds and those duplicate diamonds that we got as well before we open the chase packs. We'll check out our stub count. Wow, would you look at that? We hit exactly 100,000 stubs on the bottom. Just first base, third base, and left field open before we get into these chase packs. Nine chase pack six. Let's just open all of them rapid fire here and try and get a DeGrom. Purple on the first pack. Marcus Simeon, another duplicate. Look at from this video. 7,000 on a quick sell is not bad though. Chase pack number two. Purple again. Hose at Mike Tyson. That's Mike Tyson. 5,500. Seven more chase packs. Purple again. Three in a row. Come on. Time we got Shane McClanahan. 
85 overall. That one's only 3,000 on the quick sell. Six more chase packs. Purple again! If I don't get at least one DeGrom, I am done. Gonna punt my Xbox in the middle of the ocean. Did we just get back-to-back -back McClanahan's? All right, 3K again. Still have five to go. There's another purple. This is crazy, man. Can you at least show me some blue? David Bednar of the Pittsburgh Pirates. One of the better closures in baseball. Again, just 3,000 on the quick sell. Do another one. Purple again. Six consecutive purple diamonds. Wander. Oh, man. That's just... That's a that's an easy quick sell there. Three more chase pack. I auto flipped that one for good luck. It didn't do anything for me. Max Freed, we're gonna quick sell that one too. Two more. Come on, man. This is insanity. Come on. Pete Alonzo. 87 overall. 4,500 quick sell. Our last and final chase. We just had nine. Wow. Michael Harris, 87. Don't buy packs ever under any circumstance ever. This is the team we ended up with. Michael Harris, Lou Bob, Adolis Garcia, an infield of Pete Alonzo, Marcus Simeon, Corey Seager, Jose Ramirez, Jazz Chisholm and DH, Adley Rutschman behind the plate. We also pulled Wander and Ozzy on the bench. J-Rod is sitting there as well. Just to act like we pulled Aaron Judge. We also got Pablo Lopez and Garrett Cole, and then Josh Hader's the only noteworthy reliever. When things were all said and done, we have 137,412 stubs, so we didn't even get half of our stubs back. The good news is we have an insane amount of silver and bronze cards that we're going to be use, able to use, like I just said, on the exchanges to give us a boost in team affinity, so at least there's that. This experiment failed. I thought I was going to at least get one DeGrom. I was hoping for two on profit. That blew up in my face. Nonetheless, if you enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up down below. If you've pulled Jacob DeGrom, let me know in the comments section down below, and if you've used them, what are your thoughts? Because I haven't got my hands on them yet, but I'm about to. I don't know, man. Every time I open packs on YouTube, they tell me my account's juice. Explain that. I could really use a change of scenery. Yeah. Everybody's smoking all the greenery. Yeah. Close the match because they were handed down to me. But I'm still fly. I'm still fly. I know.